Hi everyone, I'm volcanologist Dr Janine Kripner and this is my guest. Hi, I'm Jenny Barclay. I'm a professor of volcanology at the University of East Anglia in the UK. Thank you so much for joining me. You've done some incredible work on volcanoes that have erupted over many, many years. So could you tell us a bit about that? Yes, so I'm really interested in volcanoes that quite often once they start erupting you hear about them in the news but actually you only hear about them when they do one thing and often it's part of a much longer sequence of volcanic activity that can go on for years and even decades. Yeah and some of the ones in particular that you've been studying have impacted people recently right? That's right so uh, Sufriar Hills volcano on the island of Montserrat in the Caribbean well, it first started erupting in 1995, and the last time that magma came out was in 2010, which was 15 years later. And it's still showing some signs that there's things going on underneath the volcano now. So it needs to be carefully monitored even now. Absolutely. Um, we, we know as volcanologists that volcanoes can have things happening way, down, way deep down below, which doesn't mean that anything is going to happen anytime soon, but it's, it's still important. Were you actually there when the eruptions were ongoing? Yes, yes. So obviously uh, quite a long time ago now, but I first went out there in 1996 uh, at a very early stage in my research career. Uh, and it was doing quite a wide variety of activity. And I think that's another thing is that even during one eruption, it can be quiet for a while and then suddenly it can have an explosion. And there's a lots of volcanoes like that around the world. Absolutely, that's a really important point. The activity can ramp up and then go back down and then ramp up and have lava effusion and then park this closed and then in Asheville and then the Haza yeah. for everything. Yeah, yeah. It makes volcanoes so challenging, doesn't it, to work with because, you know, they last for a long time and they can do a lot of different things. Yeah, this is definitely an international team effort. <laughs> All of us who are on the world. Thank you so much for joining me for this Volcano Moment. Thank you.